Today's the day! An underwater ecosystem teeming with life. Many associate the Great Barrier Reef with this thriving marine habitat as depicted in this Disney film. But in reality, the world's largest living structure is facing its largest existential threat in centuries. So we've put together this 400-year record of temperature changes on the Great Barrier Reef. What that showed is the recent really warm years that we've been having where the corals on the Great Barrier Reef have bleached. Uh, they are unprecedented in that 400 years, so we haven't seen temperatures really that warm. The damage done is more than just aesthetics. So why do we need the Great Barrier Reef? The coral reefs have been called the lungs of the planet. Home to thousands of plants and animals, the reefs offer food and shelter for millions of species, including turtles, dolphins, whales and manta rays. Coral reefs help keep us, our oceans and our planet healthy. Tropical coral reef ecosystems are home to at least 25% of known marine species. We'll lose a lot of those structure forming corals, so a lot of the plating ones, a lot of the, the branching corals, and these are a lot of the, the corals that fish, fish rely on, right? So we lose them, we lose the fish, we lose the whole ecosystem. Coral reefs like the Great Barrier Reef also offer coastal protection. As natural breakwaters, they help reduce the impact of tsunamis, hurricanes and typhoons on land. These vast structures have contributed to scientific research too. Coral extracts have been used to develop treatments for asthma, arthritis, cancer and heart disease. The Great Barrier Reef is also crucial for water purification and carbon dioxide absorption as well as for tracking climate change. They are actually living sensors that uh, for us sit in the ocean for hundreds of years and recording what has happened to them over many centuries uh, during their lifetime. Beyond their natural beauty, the reefs are an important economic driver. The Great Barrier Reef is one of the world's top tourist attractions. It supports more than 60,000 jobs and contributes 6.4 billion US dollar to the Australian economy. Given the Great Barrier Reef's importance, what's being done to save it? Indigenous scientists and rangers are on the front line of Australia's efforts to save the Great Barrier Reef. So as a ranger, we do heaps of restoration work. We do um, sea management, uh, land management, um, bird surveys, um, anything, you really just name it, we do a lot. Still, many say that current efforts do not go far enough. The threat that, that we could lose this place, in, at least in its current form, um, I hope is a wake-up call to, to governments around the world, uh, that we just need to do so much more and we need to take that coordinated global action.